Have you ever been through a reverse discard with a narcissist? A typical discard is when they just throw you away, they dump you out of nowhere, ghost you, cheat on you, get with somebody else. A reverse discard is when they make it so that you are forced to be the one to do the breakup. Some narcissists do this because they don't want to be the bad guy or because they're just straight up cowards that can't break up with you to your face. They will give you so little emotionally or do stuff that is so messed up and unforgivable that you are the one that are forced to end things in the relationship, even when you don't really want to. That makes them able to say, wow, can you believe that she broke up with me after all I did for her? And then proceed to go on a smear campaign and talk bad about you to their family, their friends, and yours even, and really make themselves into the victim, which is what they love to do, be the victim in any instance. So they will victimize themselves to others or to the new boyfriend or girlfriend in their life and then say, everybody ends up abandoning me, they end up leaving me, you're gonna leave too, and start the manipulation tactics over with the new person using you. This coming after the new person has no idea that they refuse to talk to you for four days until you had to send a breakup text because there was nothing left to do. A narcissist will do a reverse discard when they have drained you of all of your energy and emotions and love that you could have possibly had because you have been dealing with abuse and toxicity day in and day out to the point that you just have nothing left. They are parasites. They will suck the life out of their host until there is nothing left and then move on to the next in order to avoid a reverse discard. It's really important to put up strong boundaries. You have to find the strength within yourself to say, I'm not going to put up with this kind of treatment. I would rather be alone and happy than be with this person who continues to disrespect me. And only then will you be able to walk away and say, I did everything I could do to try to save this relationship and it was completely unsalvageable. I don't have any regrets.